Palm tree flash, Chopper trying to give them chances. Trying to save the day on this one. The bomb's kind of caught in no man's land here. Oh. Dropped up on the catwalk. Phase have got to get it. They've got 20 seconds. Magic's over at long. Phase are feeling it, man. Two sites at the same time. Reigns entering B while well, they're boosting up on the A site for picks. Magic's. Oh, he gets given one. Not out of it yet, Hugo. Don't give it away, Phase. You've got to close this. Four on one. Magic's oh. with a third. And he's onto the taps. Rain down in spawn. Orb grab. And Magic's the magic man of spirit. Pulls it out of oh, they're just giving away a sound cue or two. Let them know. Flash on over. Information oh. for Rain. And what a shot. Boomage. He's down and more for Anyone Rain. Anyone else? Anyone else want to challenge out Rain? Robs. He's got a back turn. It's hard to hit. And Electronic slaps him down. Pressure mounting as they look to bounce and bound into the A site. They can still cut off the bomb here. Carrigan might have the right maneuver about this. It's not bad, it's not bad at all. And Simple doesn't even click as he's silenced by Rain. Back and forth we go. They're tossling for control, wrestling in a three on three. 40 seconds. T side. They bomb the down. bomb in the open, courtesy of Rain. His heart beating as he's taken three out of the equation and he's not done yet. Whoa, oh, what a shot out of it. But Rain still presides over that bomb. Trying every trick to recover. It has to be Rain. Looking for no! it. Oh, the One to be immediately. Oh, Great so flash. blind. The U2 has been on point for Na'Vi throughout. Everyone working towards a common goal. Perfecto does go down, though. That's two spots. they They've been straight in towards A here. It's all on refresh. He lines oh! up. He knocks down oh! two. It just went to find Electronic in a one on three. That is a problem, a big problem, thanks to Refresh. The solo hold. And he lines up two. I think he caught a wind of Tessus. Electronic not to be underestimated in a one versus three clutch on the stage. He's got a little bit of time to flirt with. And he's coming oh! in. Oh! Refresh down, one to go, and Electronic knows. Nine seconds, Chad, he has to plan. He has to plan. Pulls the block! Oh, oh, Electronic! Oh, beautiful! Truly unbelievable! He gets off the bomb! Potentially a second critical error in the opening six rounds. And oh. Rogi, quick movements, just trying to dodge. Dive okay. back into the fight. Okay! You heard about him, and now you see him! He's planted, rig on. Susceptible to first tech nine, he's already taken down Flatro. Two frags to the good, ball of fields upon it. It's only rig on and Sonari trying to flip this on its head. Not gonna be easy. A great start. Smoke on the bomb for pressure. Falling in Short. dark. They won't be expecting this, but a miss, he has to go up. The smoke's not good. Vinny is down, the frags keep coming thanks to Rigon, and five, a full ace out of Rigon. To the A bomb site, Simple, he's posted in the pit, bit with only duelies, flashes, Simple holds the shot this time, but it won't connect, they're coming up closer, bit's gonna maul Brolin, trying to grab the gun, he can't in time, they're everywhere, over or below, inside the site, Simples need to look up as well, oh. he hits Hampus, but the parts coming in, can do nothing about it, S attack, jumping, chasing, <laughs> but Simple with a no scope and four kills from the pit, put on another round for Na'Vi. Frag follows suit, Snappy giving away his position, but with those utilities, we have Ooh. the T side. Back to the 3v3, Simple offers something. 10 seconds, and that bomb will be planted. Simple peeks wide, dies, d -hook comes around the side of Frag and sprays, bit with the double kill, and just one more. He needs the reload and he dives into the cover. Sphinx goes over oh. top and it's big bit with a big clutch on the big stage. Thompson is rotating in quickly alongside Tizian, but they stomp Faven from above. And Thompson's made moves through on the marketplace, could very well deny the bomb plant. There it comes in, but now his position is known. Three players to find in frag, second goes his way. A low Magisk has been removed, and the bomb is now down on the site. This round is in the palm of Thompson's hands, and he snatches the life out of vitality. Yeah, let's see if G2 can find it. Any sort of leg up. In case Serato loves these aggressions on the lighter buys. Hunter's just going to get sprayed on down. A great opening. Trying to claw it back, but losing bodies. These partial buys out of G2. Very uh, 
easy to control. Yeah, you notice when Fury were going fast, they were at least getting some space, right? They were able to run up the ramp. They were able to get trades. G2 can't do the same. They can't oh go fast. Oh my Ooh, god, that's an ace. Serato just aces them back to spawn. Because safe just caught some heavy nade damage as well. Yeah, it might not be anyone healthier soon because there's more banana aggression behind this. They've smoked off the half wall. Nico's going to push further forward. I think he's going <gasps> to spam on through. Yuri gone immediately. That was one of the healthy ones. Armored and healthy, not anymore. Here's some more oh. bullets. <laughs> okay. Nico keep going to rinse and repeat. It's working. On the way through into Nico. 3k out of him. More to come. More to follow, I think. K Serato, you can see they're asking him to do it with a. Uh, Disadvantage. No armor for him, but better of the two. Yeah, it might be the ace here for Nico. I think he's going to stay postured forward here. The fact that the bomb lines at his feet, they can rotate across. And he's going to spam even more shots through. So this is Nico looking to get all the damage done. This round is concluded because look at the push behind. There's no way out of Banana right now. And the ace looking likely. Nico will add one to the tally. Back in the day, we thought it was impossible, and Rain believed. The longest standing member stands to receive Na'Vi. What a menace here. He's sucked in again. He's taken the first fight, and they're still coming his way. Rain's looking to do more damage. He has a smoke, but he might just use his weapon. They're ready, but so is he! Rain! That is absolutely ludicrous! Around, and as he comes out mid to B, does get a fight. The first eagle shot. Confirms his position, and now Spirit can get that bomb down. Patsy gets the confirmation that he has stuck oh! around and knocks his head off. Dexter. He's got so much util, but Nico, the ever-present. Threat holds oh! his nerve and holds the line. <laughs> Neutralized by the Nico Deeg. Copenhagen Flames can... Oh! Wait a second. Either they win their first pistol... Nikodaz has a swing. He's or so rain low. Clutches. And with Nikodaz being this low, that Glock's just going to hone in on him from a 1v3 into the 1v1, uh -oh. and Zyphon is so far away. How's this bomb plant looking? He can play within the cave. It's pistols, right? So you're not going to expect the spams to come through. He's trying to read the rotation, but he's just splitting the difference at this point. Tucking, hoping that the CT walks into his crosshair. Now he's going to probably hear Zyphon running up. Siphon not looking the right direction. Rain. Oh no! He misses his first chances. Oh, he still but wins. Still closes it out, man. That's <laughs> wow. crazy. 1v3 from. Now that they get those two steps closer, do they just want to take this? They're going to press hard into the pit. It twists. Oh my god. With a quick flick of his wand, they're all gone. Mix them up. Easy pickups on this half by Froki with a lending hand. Phase two rounds away. Vitality are still in a very awkward position. Again, Connector is free reign, free real estate on the side of Heroic, so they can push back and forth and look for fast rotational plays. But there is now not much time on the clock, and Heroic will need to make a decision and stick with it. Damage done to on the monster, but they've still pushed up. And this player is running with their knives out, they have no idea. And Mages with three deeks shuts the round down. Shush can do little but try running, oh! and Major smacks him upside the head too. Information at a premium for Heroic. It might have to be Cadian. There's no quick rotations to help Cadian here. This is on him. And the first he chooses to engage. Chopper lives on. Loses the bomb. Ten seconds. They really need to find this leader. Oh! And he's clicked them all. Three, four, and so will the round. There's no time and no heads left. Cadian. That will invigorate him, already feeling himself, and four clicks of the USP, he will ace. Drop to disrupt, flashed off, hard clears for G2, and it's Jax, his first victim. 10 seconds, Nico has to find it, drop! He could be doing it all for Furia, all alone oh. on the side, takes down Monacy, and that's a drop shutdown! Pulls it out of absolutely nowhere! But he's questioning where are Spirit? They could be anywhere. And in fact, they are already through the back line, climbing into the window as Chopper. It's a clash of the in game leaders. Carrigan goes one step too far behind. Hang on a moment. This is actually pretty smart, I think. He knows, he knows the bomb's down there. Carrigan doesn't want to be sat on the bomb. That's too obvious. And they're leaving themselves in no time. He wants to play for the 1v3. Oh, there's a surprise. Out from behind, triple. Carrigan knows they've got to come to him. He's the man to do the damage. From oh! the swing! in the water! 
any Na'Vi resistance. Is this where things change? Or can FaZe fight three on four? It's up to Carrigan. Brokey does hit the shot. And Carrigan good for the headshot now. Running out of options. Oh, and that'll oh, do! Oh. That'll do nicely! I'll let you have five, but enough is enough. Exactly. Oh, man. This actually might be a hard save. They've got one inside the bathrooms. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's tag smartly is coming back to the site, but there's actually two players here ready nice to attack shots. him. Nice Could he do shots. it? Yeah, he's staying alive, and he's knocking out. Nice five. shots. Wow, 5 10. Pushing in the face, and now three kills from the final of the PGL Major. Spirit moving in. Plays are here. They're ready for this. This hole decides it all. Carrigan up and over the top, and here in the Diamond City, he's going huge, going nuclear. Oh! He can get Flame, nades, flashes, spray, it's all heroic, simple, decides to flip it, a double out of him, more encroaching, he needs to step up, but simple three, just the cherry on top required out of electronic, he's got no time, that AWP, can he really do anything with it? Median, a quick one, one remains. So that all of Na'Vi's hard work was for naught. The Orb connects for his 20th. This could be it. Cadian to put them onto 15. Clear and throw! Oh, oh, oh. And there you have it! Puts the A, W, and P in Antwerp. Massive stop from Cadian here. Heroic now up to 15. Bolts is hiding in the ladder room by the looks of it. Nikodos, he tries to get aggressive down the ramp. That's a lot of bodies confirmed. Presence has been seen, it has been heard. And Nikodos still floating with this fight, flirting Ooh. with death as he dances on FNX and then follows up onto Vinny. A clean 5v3 for Copenhagen Flames as they take barely any damage. Oh, oh and he goes right back for more. Three frags for Nikodos. Oh, a fourth! Everything he needs on this site. Daphne. Oh, it's a battle between Rain and Naphne, and Rain comes out on top. He's been tagged on to 41 HP, but still able to get back the man advantage. Never mind, Carrigan is a lunatic. Runs on in, catches Shiro all by his lonesome. And this is what FaZe love to do. This is what FaZe will do at you. They are just going to keep aggressing, going to be in your face, disrespecting you. And they're going to make you not just like feel like you're losing, but make it feel even more painful. Just twist the knife in. Axel, what's he going to do? Well... A 1v4, now to a 1v2. This is suddenly, all of a sudden, doable. Rain, bear in mind, is on 20 HP. The only thing going against Axel right now is the fact that the bomb is far, far away out in the open, but he does have time. Exactly, just shy of 50 seconds, but that bomb position is the biggest obstacle to him clutching this round. Rain knows it additionally, as does Rops. They're both positioned accordingly. And Axel's just checking all of his angles. Rops is coming all the way around the back now. Even if Axel's able to best Rain and pick up the bomb, Rops is in such a good position to try and thwart either of these bomb sites. And Axel has taken the head of Rain, picks up the bomb, has to rush straight towards the site, and Rops should know this. Rops is in good position for the cross. Axel's going to be coming down, though, and decides to vent dive. Throws in the curveball. And the He's going to have enough time as well. The Molotov buys him up enough time, and Rops runs through the volley <laughs> to his death. Rops, are you okay? What is this clutch? Holding the line to try offer a helping Ooh. hand. Look at this, oh, goes running in. Hello. Stops what? the bomb and then follows up. It's fallen to help. Okay, G2, there's only one man left inside of the site. Nico no. dead on the A lurk and Modesty is gonna do it all alone. Oh, yeah. Hopping on in, 1v3 turned 1v2. Scoped up, Cyclops mode, looking for them. Vinny's eluded him for the time being, is now wrapping around behind, but up the short side. Oh, Ooh, it's quick, Modesty doubles no. up and there it is. Four in the round and the clutch goes his way. It's dire, they're trapped in the site with two. Post plant for sure. Rops is meant to win this round should the situation call for it, but you need the rest of the gang to thin the herd. Rops is out wide, fighting currently. Twists, still waiting for a long peak. 
so measured for Spirit, so slow until they intend to move in, until they intend to go. And here it is, both players fight back oh. to back in this side. Froggy with one, no Twitch way. follows up, it's a 1v1! Oh man, oh close, no. Twitch! Attempt fate by moving back in to be late in the round. Twists up close. Will he be checked? Oh, it comes down to this. Will they pick the oh! right? He just turns away. That's an opener. Now they're moving in. Up in the window. Rops is bought down low. They've got to concede. They've got to fight from the double doors. They've at least kept FaZe looking pretty in the 4v2. Ooh. Oh, spam on the bomb. Not a kill yet. Magix wins his tunnels fight. This is starting to spiral out of control for FaZe. Still got the man advantage, but at what cost? Rops is low. He's tapered. He can't lead the charge on this one. It's going to have to be someone else. Rain out through the doors. Brokey alongside him. Magic no swinging way. and winning. 1v1. Rain can't find him in time. The He's bomb. got him back into the tunnels, but the bomb's not for him. Oh, Magic, you've got to be quick here. 10 seconds. No kick. Oh! And Magic wins the round. Ace. All five and a 2v5 to get it done. In combination with Carrigan is potentially going to be the day. Start his spray, went down, and no one, no one provides a response. They have the numbers now on the commit. Carrigan, trigger happy. It's broke. He's all the managers to find something, but already he's been silenced. Navi's trades are so strong. He gets the bomb, gets two again. Carrigan does not surrender. And simple stop. Risks continue to be taken. Heroic trying to find gaps when there aren't. It's a hard duel for anyone to take. Oh, but Tessis has caught him off. They know what that means. Two victims lying on the A site. It's 20 seconds posted up. As everybody's favorite villain has pit on lock. We will see a plant, surely. And they will extend play. Bit still a problem, but the bomb is down. 2v4 demanded. Of heroic Na'Vi, the cavalry canters in already though. We see it boil down to just Tessus. Trying to activate. Oh, oh my god! Oh. Tessus in Antwerp no less! Some people lose themselves here, but he finds himself on the stage! I don't know about the palace play in this situation, and Nico's gonna know that this is Bit walking up into the bottom of the neck once again. He's been doing that. And there's Jax with just one. Nico. He's able to get something in the middle of it all. Keeps that man advantage up for G2. Oh, he saw that. Simple saw that jump. He expects it. Perfecto just plant that bomb with his 9 HP. Oh. Simple predicting the angle, but honestly looking to bring it back from CT spawn. Now Simple knows the last two positions, but can he hit the shots? Oh, he's... oh, we know he can, but the question is, will he hit these ones? He's not playing on default. This is a trick. 40 HP, and they are going to think he's in a certain number of positions, but this means he has to get a kill early to play back towards a bomb. Smoke goes in. Oh, that's Alexi. That's Alexi down, and now it's another one versus one. Oh, and Simple oh, wins it this time. Plucks him out with the AK-47. Alexi has to go above and beyond once again. This force by war has continued, and it could be just a few moments away from breaking G2 yet again. Now, Lexi's got to make a move here. Time is running so dry, so low. He feels like Tetris has been called off, but now he's going to find out. Oh, oh, oh my God! The flick to Hades' head. Is there enough time for the fin? He's got there it! There is! He's got it! He's not like this, Vitality. It could be, it could be like this. <laughs> Please, not like this. Frag grenade. Ooh. Oh, look oh, at that! That's money. That's that is so much damage. That's your mommy. Nav's going to get in ace. Woo! That's four kills and the tap away. That's so true. Tessis is baiting him out. And now it's down. Needs to deliver. And deliver. He shall with two kills. Looking for a third. Gets it down as well and still alive. Oh. Still clicking head. Still fragging out. And the young man has picked up four. Brokey. Whoa. This attack's already crossed, but he's too scoped in. Brokey. Oh, okay. For a second. And this guy simply does oh. not miss statements every time.